Hi, everybody, and welcome to the Gen 6 virtual shopping event. And as a thank you for joining us for this special event, you will actually receive 10% off a Gen 6 purchase right now. What's good, YouTube? Is your boy. Guys, I guess we back at it. Hey, so I got a nice video for you guys. We're going to be watching and looking at the new Gen 6 watch, fossil watch with Google. Um, get some more information on what's going on with that. Now, I'm not exactly looking towards buying it, but I'm just curious on what's going on with the technology and everything with the new fossil watch. Now, don't worry. Yes, I'm still going to do a nice review reaction to the Google Pixel 6. I got it in the mail. I ordered it. <laughs> I'm just waiting for it to come. So you guys can wait on that. Besides the point, right here, nicely right behind me, is the hybrid smartwatch. Now, I have this one right here, and it's absolutely gorgeous. Let me see. I want it. Is it going to focus? Is it going to focus? At, there we go. As you guys can see, absolutely gorgeous. And I, I just, I'm just curious on what's the difference. Like, should I upgrade or should I just, you know, keep my money in my pocket and just keep what I have, you know, and everything. And you guys can nicely tell, B-I-G, it was all a dream. Let's not waste any time. Let's hop in and watch this review see you in like five seconds five minutes five se well five seconds for you five minutes for me all right all right all right let's go we got three more minutes until this thing starts a few moments later hi everybody and welcome to the gen 6 virtual shopping event um my name is ryan and we are live here Let's at go. toronto eaton center here um at fossil at the store um i would like to thank each and every one of you for uh joining in and welcome to our event um so we're here to talk about the gen 6. all right um, i'd That's like good. to introduce um myself. so i've been with the company for about 13 years now, um, and I have been a part of this smartwatch uh, launch since um, Gen 1 uh, back in 2015, which is exciting that we're actually on our sixth um, touchscreen smartwatch version already, and it's been fantastic. Um, so first things first, um, who already owns a Fossil smartwatch or product? Raise your hand um, by clicking uh, the button uh, below. Um, if you want to pipe in, oh, Malik, raise the hand, so go away. I have the hybrid uh, Fossil Watch. Mm -hmm. It's pretty good. It hasn't uh, let me down or anything like that. So I'm just curious on how the new Fossil Watch is going to look like and what, what you guys have in tail for it. Oh, for sure. Yeah, I can't wait to um, show you the features. So um, that's going to be fun. Um, what about you, Jen? I recently got a hybrid HR and I'm really enjoying the features. So um, I am also looking forward to hearing what the newest uh, generation has to offer. Fantastic. And the Gen 6 here. So when you purchase one with us, it'll come in this really cool box with the ombre rainbow six here. Um, if you haven't seen um, it or this first time to seeing it, um, the smartwatches, then we do partner with Google. Um, it is run by um, Wear OS by Google. Um, and then this is the box that it comes in. It's very beautiful and striking. Um, so uh, we're gonna unbox one right now. All right. So in the box, we'll come with your watch. I wish they unboxed the and it also silver comes one over here, the with one a charger. Over here. I'm quite curious on that We'll one. talk more about that later. I, I like the and look then you'll it. have nice your couple of booklets over here. It's going to be the usual books and shit. Pluck them and follow them. So as you can see on the screen, um, the Gen 6 actually comes in seven versions. So there's four 44 millimeter versions. Um, you can see the colorways and the pricing on here. So they started about 429 and go to 459. It's expensive. And then we have the 42 millimeter version. Real expensive. 
um, that comes in three colorways, um, and it's 429 and 459 as well. Usually 459 is the one with the metal bracelets, and 429 will be the ones with either the nylon um, silicone See, I like or the metal straps. bracelets. That's just my um, cup of so tea, you know what I'm saying, guys? Seven styles that Rocking we have currently available. The nice the metal, six. it just looks more... So there were things to that uh, we're going to talk about how it's way faster um, with the Snapdragon Wear 4100 plus platform and Bluetooth 5 and how it yeah. charges in about 30 minutes to 80 percent. We're also going to talk about some of the wellness updates that we did with the Gen 6 and right. how much you can customize the watch uh, given the watch face, the straps um, and the apps that you can download. And then on the other half, I'm going to show you some tips and tricks on how to keep your smartwatch updated. Um, listen to music with Spotify, um, the battery modes, how you can make and take phone calls right on the watch, and also some of my favorite apps. Okay. Let's keep it up. Let's keep it All up. All right. So I'm going to stop sharing this presentation so that you can see that I'm actually wearing my Gen 6 right now. All right. Um, I'm wearing one with the black silicone and the black thing. And you can see that it has a super high res display. So it actually uses the 4100 plus platform. So you can see my notifications there and you can see how snappy everything um, feels and responds. So as you can see, there you go. And then let me launch an app over here. And it launches it very quickly. All right, all right. It also has the Google Assistant feature. So when you swipe to the right, you'll get your Google Assistant. Nice. And then if you swipe to the left, you'll get your tiles. So right now I have it set up to workouts, weather. Okay. Uh, nice, I guess nice, it's slightly nice. raining here in Toronto right now. <laughs> your step, uh, Google Fit um, stats. I also have it set up for um, the new blood oxygen reading that we will get okay. to in a second. Sleep tracking, actually, you know, let me put Alexa, which is actually here. coming out as a feature in yeah. November. So stay tuned for that. More oh, details. that's interesting. Alexa's Not coming tonight, back to this. but we will have more details about the Alexa configuration. That's actually also my sister my loves Alexa. So. Phone app. There you go. So as you can see with the design, it very looks, it looks like a watch. It feels like a watch when you're wearing it. It's constructed beautifully. I wonder um, if you can pay the difference stuff between on the, the Gen 4, the Gen 5 and the Gen 6 is that now it has this um, inset molded uh, charging ring. So that's how we actually are able to get it faster um, to charge because it's right it, um, attached to the battery now. And it actually allows, um, the sensors to work a little bit better just because now um, it's closer to um, your skin on your wrist. Okay. Um, it also has the three pushers over here. The two you can customize at the top and button here. So I have the top one toggling my wellness features. I'm not exactly wild yet. I'm being honest with you guys. Will, um, turn on oh, NFT. Shit. So if you have Google Pay. It's nice though. It's nice. And then the middle one will just really okay. um, go to your app drawer and show you a list of your apps. Yeah. And then the watch also has Bluetooth 5 connectivity now. So what it does is that it actually has a longer range um, for your phone and your watch. Um, so now um, I can probably um, leave my phone. Um, I usually leave my phone in the bedroom charging. I can actually wear my watch um, in my backyard and still have access to my notifications because it'll okay. still um, have that connection. That's a good range. And That's if it ever disconnects, range. It will still work as a watch. It will still keep track of your steps, um, et cetera. And then once it reconnects back to the phone, um, I have a Pixel 5 with me, so I have an Android. It literally takes seconds to reconnect once um, it's back in Bluetooth range. So that's what one of the advantages of Bluetooth 5. Okay. okay. And then the next advantage is that it has the new charging um, method. So our smartwatch, uh, the Gen 6, will actually charge in about 30 minutes to 80%, which is really, really fast. Um, so like I said, it does come with a charging um, ring over here. Oh, I have a couple of questions. Um, go for it, Taiwan. Hey, can you hear me? Yes, I can. Awesome. Yeah, I'm wondering if the, the issues with uh, charging have been resolved since Gen 5. I know there are several with the, the ring coming um, unglued. 
at the mm -hmm. back and has that been resolved um, or is there extended warranty perhaps on the new gen 6 to resolve that, I didn't know that was a problem yeah so um what happens uh with that one is that now like i mentioned um the rings are actually insert molded into the case back so you can see that it's actually like right underneath the casing okay. so this one cannot be um removed anymore okay awesome. yeah so you you can feel um safe and secure that that shouldn't happen why was it like that in the first place? Yeah. Like, and then what? with a the new charging um, adapter too, it has the four um, pins now. So it actually um, attaches to the charging rings uh, much better. And that's what also gives it um, the me. extra charging boost. No, we didn't. I don't have that on mine. Well, no fucking shit. That's interesting. All right. Um, it says that um, somebody else has a question. I'm pretty sure that's the same unknown guy, but like. Oh, you're still on mute if you want to. Okay, so we'll just um, continue on. So one of my favorite things about um, the smartwatch as well is that the endless customization. So with our watches, you can actually customize the watch dials. So you can act. Um, you can make it look like an analog watch. See, I like analog. You can customize um, so much more professional. The dials as well. But being able to switch so from analog to digital the rings is quite nice. Inside the watch, you can customize the dial color. Ooh. Um, this is actually um, one of the best features of the smartwatch. So now you can see that it's um, a burgundy color, which is our color of the season here in the store. Um, nice, and then nice. you're also able to download more watch faces from the Play Store. Our watch, our Gen 6 will also come preloaded with Facer. Um, I haven't set it up yet, What's but Facer? if you have the Facer app, then you can actually you have access to thousands more um, watch faces in the library. And with That's the Facer app, Facer. you can also make your own, um, which is really cool. And then with the um, customization too, is that our watches have the quick release pins at the back, so you literally just oh. remove the strap. Okay, okay. And then I have a few leather straps here that you can purchase with a watch. Looks right nice. now, my favorite is this olive green. And then it's very easy to snap back on. Snap, crackle, pop. There you go. <laughs> just listen for the clicks. <laughs> And there you go. Just like a new watch. Okay. You can really um, personalize it in a way um, that's See, really unique to I know my, my dad, you. he loves the leather um, bands. It was especially so with the color options that we have. He goes we to, even have you know, like black so leather. So he can change it and everything. Um, we have other color so silicone when he goes straps to the gym, for workouts. To when he goes um, we even to have metal so. um, Me personally, as I said before, here. I'm still more we with the... We have the classic three-row metal band. bracelet. Um, and then for the 42 millimeter um, options, we actually just received the holiday colors, which is red, green, and we have yes. this metallic silver at the moment, which is my favorite. And then we also have some nylon colorful options. So the possibilities are endless for the customization, which we love because you don't need to buy another smartwatch. You can just um, keep buying straps and customizing the watch faces, and you'll be able to um, personalize your watch to own to your own unique style. So that is one of the wonderful aspects of owning a Fossil Gen Six. All right, any questions so far? No questions for me. All right, fantastic. So. Another update that we did uh, with the Fossil Gen 6 is um, a few wellness optimizations. So as you can see here, we have added um, the blood oxygen um, reading. So now you're able to t track your SpO2 max. Um, so it's actually the amount of oxygen that is circulating in your body at, um, at any given time. Um, so when you do a reading, you're just going to wear the watch um, and make sure it's a little bit higher up on your wrist. So I'm going to wear it right here. And then I'm just going to do a quick reading. Um, so you just have to remain still because it's not going to read um, your blood oxygen 
when um, it's uh, doing it. It takes about 30 seconds to read. Um, it actually will track your blood oxygen as well um, okay. when you're doing sleep tracking with it. So you can actually um, sleep, I'm being honest with you. I don't know what person wears the watch levels, to sleep, um, but... In time and how your uh, body <laughs> I really never understood that piece shit. Because, um, like, you work to sleep, guys, and like, everything. Um, like, like a medical device. Um, you how are you going to get a charge? You to um, make sure that if you're not feeling well, you start to check in with your doctor. And there you go. It's read my blood oxygen. Oh, that was too quick. It's at 94%, um, which is good. You want to keep your blood oxygen level to about 85% to um, 100% at any given time. Yeah, no idea. Um, and like I said, <laughs> I no um, idea about all that. these wellness features are just, um, just metrics to see how... Um, but I mean, honestly, one picture of your you health really is doing um, so step tracking um, sleep tracking and like I, blood oxygen tracking are three of the kind of I'm like little parts like when I'm of done your wellness work, journey as well as your fitness click, click, click. so if you're keeping like active and bad. you're staying top of your um, know in the uh, step you counts or sleep the then you know that you have a whole picture on the wellness any questions so far about the wellness updates Nah. <laughs> All right, so we are going to move on to some of the tips and tricks that I keep. Um, I use to keep my um, smartwatch updated. So when you first pair your uh, Gen Six, um, you it's going to download an update. But to make sure that you do have the updates, um, just go to the Play Store on the watch. And then you are going to swipe down um, to where you see my apps. And then if you have any updates to complete, it's actually just going to show up on here. Um, so you can see that all mm -hmm. my apps have been recently updated. You're always going to make sh uh, sure that all of these apps are updated just to keep it at the best version um, on the watch, um, because in most cases, when your um, when your watch is um, lagging behind or not functioning properly, it's just an app update. Um, and also, the way that I keep um, my watch updated is that um, I keep track of system updates too. When your watch is connected to Wi-Fi, it'll automatically download um, the update when it's connected to the charger. So you can also manually keep track of updates by going to settings and swiping down to system and then to about, and then you are just going to check for system updates at the bottom here. See how fast the, this um, watches. And then there you go. My system is currently up to date. So we know that it's going to work properly. Um, with the battery life on this one, since I keep it updated, my uh, Gen 6 lasts me about 42 hours. Um, and I actually um, have it as oh. my daily driver. So all the daily features Where are turned on. Last you 48 um, I hours? use it maybe for an hour a day, um, five times a week um, to go for walks. Um, and I track That's my it. walks on know. here. This is my type of watch. Um, and I'm like I said, it still lasts me 42 hours. My um, hybrid, it, it lasts like um, two everything's weeks. Turned on. <laughs> Um, the main point like of weeks. the updates is to keep the battery health on your watch good. And also, one of my tricks is that when you have the Wear OS app on your phone, you don't need all the notifications to show up on your watch. So I actually customize my notifications. So I only have the most important apps that I want to get notified on, on my watch, and then the rest are off. Um, so for this one, you actually just pick and choose right on the app so that you're not getting bombarded with um, a lot of notifications right on the wrist. Um, because the more notifications you get, the more wa the watch vibrates and the more the display actually um, turns on. Only so notification that's one of the you reasons, truly um, need, text message, the battery, um, and cell might phone. Not, uh, like might cell phone calls. Faster. That's but it. But like I said, you don't really driver, need, it lasts me about You don't really hours. need to have like uh, Any questions too much so far of, about the uh, battery life. Too much of a. I can't oh, think right now. Oh my gosh. The hand. <laughs> Go ahead. Yeah, and you said the, that 40 hours was, was with um, most things turned on. So all the yes. uh, health tracking and I guess always on display as well. 
Yes, uh, my always on display is um, on all the time. Um, I just um, have the tilt to wake or touch to wake turned off um, just because I do talk with my hands a lot. So it yeah. actually, <laughs> it accidentally turns on my display all the time. Um, but you just push the button and the watch wakes up. It's very quick. Um, I have tried it with um, uh, tilt to wake on too. And it still lasted me about 32 hours. Um, just because the Gen 6, the way that the Snapdragon so Wear 4100 Plus uh, processor works is that all the wellness hours, tracking, yeah. so the heart rate monitoring, um, step tracking, blood oxygen, and sleep um, are using the Lil processor, so it doesn't mm -hmm. wake up the bigger one. Um, so that definitely conserves your battery life. Okay. Um, I, I guess in terms of like longevity, um, mm -hmm. I, from experience with with the Gen Five, on like mm -hmm. how long does your battery de like it will deplete over time, like just with lithium ion batteries? But mm -hmm. does your battery life um, after two years is it completely gone? No, because um, I actually have the Gen Five and the Five E myself, and my battery life on those two um, up until I got the Gen Six mm -hmm. were still the same. Um, with the Gen Five, I was getting probably about thirty two hours on um, on mine, okay. um, and like I said, like as long as you um, like do your battery just because over time like i've been using the touchscreen smartwatches for about six years now um over time you learn how to use it and what uh, features actually matter the most to you mm -hmm. so then it'll actually get your battery life going um much better okay um i guess the, does fossil offer like a battery change perhaps after two years or um, um, is that not a thing it, you can send it for a battery change um after two years um it's just that you'll have to um pay for the battery replacement at that uh, time yeah, um, but like i said once if you take care of the battery, the battery like, if you just charge it um yep. like when it needs to be charged um mm -hmm. like i said this has quick charging now so you really just put it on the charger for 30 minutes so that actually protects the battery health over time yeah um, charging versus like down yeah. to zero mm -hmm. exactly yeah because you're not uh, plugging it in like overnight or for two three hours Hours, so that actually protects the battery health on um, the smartwatch even better. Okay, um, I guess yeah. Follow the question. I have. Oh, are the the other battery modes. Have you used those? Are they? Are yes, you, are they, um, the I'm actually about to talk about that. Yeah. yeah. Continue, so. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So yeah, we have battery modes on the smartwatch as well. So oh. if you swipe down. Okay. Oh. Okay. And you touch the battery icon. So you have the daily mode, which I use. Um, the extended mode um, will help you out if you want, um, if you forgot your charger. This actually extends your battery life for about two days. Because what it does is that it turns off all the essential features um, minus the health tracking. Um, so it will keep, still keep track of your steps and your heart rate. Um, it will really have a Bluetooth that. So schedule. I wonder if I could turn um, that so off. So it will turn your Bluetooth off. Um, from a certain time, um, like 7 a.m. to 10 p.m., um, because you don't really need it for sleep tracking. And then you also have the custom mode, which I'll show you guys. Yeah, I just needed so to you check my really, messages, my um, phone calls. Drill That's pretty down. much it. Bonus is being able to change so, my yeah. music so on the fly. So I'm not, I don't want to keep pulling out my phone. You can actually I set just, it to custom, so you can I actually like my music. Um, figure out which ones you want to turn on and which ones you want to turn off. Um, and then you're able to customize that to um, whatever uh, mode you want. So you can turn off and on the settings. So then you'll have a more custom variation on the battery mode. It also turns on the battery um, extended mode in about um, once you're at 10% or at uh, like uh, at 5%. And you can also customize that feature as well. Any questions so far about the battery modes? Nah. All right, perfect. So one of my favorite apps uh, on the watch as well is Spotify. So it will also come preloaded with the watch once you set it up. Oh, okay. And a new feature on Spotify that they just released is you can actually download playlists on the watch now. So as you can really? see, I have my Discover Weekly playlist here. And then if you have um, a Bluetooth headset or earbuds paired with your watch, um, you can actually um, download and listen to your playlist right here. I actually use this um, feature uh, very well when I'm going out for a no. run or walking. I don't know. Um, 
then you'll be able download to have access to your downloads on watch, um, right on the watch. To... So you don't even need to bring your phone with you just because um, whenever I'm running challenge. errands yeah. um, just across the street to the grocery store, I already have Google Pay set up. Um, so I don't even need my wallet with me. I can just listen to my music as well because it'll just be right on the watch. Um, the but offline downloading will uh, cell work cell with Spotify with premium Guys, accounts and also not YouTube with their music cell premium. Um, I'm so guessing if you two, misplace um, it, apps and a good services backup? that you're able to use offline downloading. Any questions about the offline downloading feature for music? Nope. Oh, oh Tyvon. Sir, how much storage is the internally does the watch have again? Uh, the Gen 6 is eight gigabytes. Hey, there we okay. go. Thanks. Yeah, I have about maybe four playlists and I am still at about five gigabytes. Um, it's not gonna like um, download obviously the highest quality music um, file on the watch mm -hmm. itself just because it saves storage. But if you're using um, your, like I said, Bluetooth earbuds, I have mine paired up with the Pixel Buds, um, the music still um, actually um, is um, really well. All right, thanks. Oh, you're welcome. Okay, okay, okay. Still not sold, but it's a decent watch. All right. So finally, one of my favorite apps um, that's right on the watch is the phone app. Um, so when you actually set up your watch, you'll be able to um, kind of set it up to see what your answer preference is. So you can either, um, if you get your phone call notification, you can accept on watch and answer your phone or you can actually accept um, on watch as well. So we're just gonna switch so to that feature. To watch? And then I'm actually just gonna call the store. The so you're gonna hear the phone ring <coughs> from watch. So then you're actually gonna See, I've be had... able <coughs> to contact your phone. So I had the guys, the I'm just old school call... watch before, the one with these that had a camera on it. <laughs> Quite interesting. But like from that, from then to now, they've changed up a whole bunch of stuff. Now the ones with the cameras also didn't have those more there Samsung. There you go. And then but once you plug that in, you can actually this is cool. right I'm right on the watch. That is so cool, right? It's one of the most impressive features on the smartwatch, just because nice you can actually walk around and kind of like talk on the phone, like James Bond or Inspector Gadget. <laughs> I mean, no offense, you kind of look like an idiot. Any Yo. questions about the Yo, phone feature on the watch? Oh, can you? Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. All right. So, there are more strap options here. So you can see for your watch oh, that I'm move. loading up. We have more available on the website, um, you so you'll be able to um, see that guys. there. And as a thank you for joining us for this special event, you will actually receive 10% off a Gen 6 purchase right now. So hopefully Excellent. you have all created a Fossil.com account um, and have your payment method saved in your profile. Um, this is actually a fantastic incentive um, just because right now the Gen 6 is still um, at full price. Um, so now you're going to be receiving up to $45 off your purchase. Um, it's actually going to be your entire transaction. So if you want to purchase um, an additional strap with it, you're going to get 10% off your entire order. If you want to purchase other stuff um, like bracelets, um, we have matching um, bracelets here for the 42 millimeter sizes. And we also have complimentary bracelets as well for men. I wear a bracelet with mine, um, which kind of completes the look and also um, rings. Um, so if you want to accessorize your wrists, please feel free to um, let us know. Um, and raise your hand if you're ready to purchase. Um, and then you will either, uh, you'll be taken out to a private room with either myself or Pranav. All your information will be secure. Um, so we can go ahead and purchase your um, Fossil Gen 6. Yeah, I'm not sold, as I said. And then if you have any <laughs> questions, I will be here available um, to answer any of them. Um, I wonder if that's it for the... 
this video. <laughs> I'm not I'm not sold for this doing uh this Gen 6. I'm still more towards the hybrid I have. This you know what it lasts. Alright, is weeks. anybody ready to purchase the Gen 6? Yeah, no. I I'm pretty sure this is gonna be it, guys. Uh, yeah, I said the, the hybrid it lasts a lot more. Like it lasts longer. All right. Two weeks. Well, if that's it, it um, I want to thank everybody for stopping by Still? and tuning into the event. Oh. Um, I it's been a wonderful time um, showcasing the Gen Six features for everybody, um, and we hope that you've learned and um, kind of understood what our Gen Six smartwatch is about and seen all the features. Um, so yeah, so like I said, raise up your hand um, and let us know in the chat if you want to purchase the Gen Six today with the ten percent off offer. Um, because it'll be um, the best deal that you can get right now. All right. Like I said, my name is Ryan. Anytime you guys are in Toronto, um, please visit the Toronto Eaton Center location. We'll be here to answer all your smartwatch questions. And yes, Jen. Oh, I, I raised my hand for purchase. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Yeah, guys, that's it. So, <laughs> as I said before, the hybrid launch I have is more than good enough, all right? It answers my phone calls. I can still see who's calling and stuff. I mean, like, I don't talk to it on the watch itself, but it's like, I can see who's calling me so I can pull up my phone and answer the phone. I see who's texting me still, and it looks really classy. Like, that's, that's the only two thing you guys really need. Like, the heart monitor and stuff, like, I'm not going to be running around and exercising and stuff that's just not that's not what i'm doing i'm more just going about my day because like this times you know you have your phone on vibrate you're in a meeting and everything and buzz 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 just that's it simple that's all you, that's all you guys need anyways hit the like button and subscribe for more good videos i'll see you on the next one Yeah